Welcome back to another episode of the Motor City Magnet Fishers. There's nothing more refreshing on a hot summer day than a nice, crisp, cool Stroh's beer. I'm kidding, I don't even drink, but I got this really cool can out of the river yesterday. I got one exactly like it, only in better condition in this video, well, as well as a couple of other cool things. So check this video out. As always, like and subscribe to our channel if you do enjoy our videos, and thank you so much for watching. Piece of steel, catfish bell, and a bunch of bottle caps. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I didn't know you were all the way down here. There you go, we got you un untangled. I'm sorry about that. I'll move down a little bit. No, you're good. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you. Yep. Part of a lighter? Yes, sir. And uh, just a bunch of gunk. Okay, got padlock. some random bits of metal really not much on that one. Oh wait got a lid to a flat top beer can and uh, I don't know what that is so I got a uh, a fishing lure and a bunch of bottle caps and a washer got a little fishing lure and then Miller High Life got uh, part of a pop can old flat top Got a nine volt battery. Uh, that's about it. About all that we pulled on that one. All right. Got another can. Got uh, another lure. That one's nasty. Got another lure. Got a catfish bell. And what's this? More washers. You can't see them, but I can feel the hole in the center. Fishermen use those as well. Got a <laughs> shiv. It's a piece of a barrel. And a bottle cap. Wow, that is cool. I'm gonna keep this one. Let me pour the water out and I'll show it to you guys. That's in really good shape. That is an old Stroh's flat top beer can. Look how good a shape that's in. There is like almost no rust on it whatsoever. Let's see. Okay, <laughs> I don't know what all we have here. I got oh, big old hunk of metal. There was some uh, glass on there. Got part of a fishing reel. 
We got a nasty rag. Got a booze bottle cap. Uh, I don't know what that is. We'll save that because that might that might be a coin. And then just a bunch of gunk. Give me one second. Let me go pull this bucket down here. Got something with a little weight to it. Well, that's interesting. I don't... <laughs> it's off a uh, weed whip. And a piece of iron ore. And... Getting a lot of bubbles. Okay. Another beer can. That one's not in good shape. We got, uh, looks like the remnants of a Dixie Dancer on there. We got uh, part of a fish stringer. Kind of a can, chunk of steel, catfish bells, and then what's this? It's uh, just a rock. Looks like I just got a screwdriver. Yep, Stanley. We'll put that in the keep bucket in case it's salvageable. Sinkers. Save those. Got a catfish bell. And a whole bunch of gun. Got another beer can. Oh no, that's bigger than a beer can. Eh, some kind of a can. Drywall anchor. A knife blade. A piece of metal. Got a little padlock with keys. That's about it. Pair of needle nose pliers, fishing line, a couple of rusty nuts, a sinker, keep that, and a bottle cap. A piece of welding rod, another crank off a fishing reel, bottle cap, part of a catfish bell. Catfish bell, link to a chain. Okay. There's a decent sinker. Don't know. There's something big down there, though. Of a catfish bell. Looks like a castle nut.
Okay, biggest find of the day. Nothing. Nothing but leaders and hooks and Oh, I had a bunch of fishing line on there. A whole bunch. I guess it all broke. And most of it broke. Huh? <laughs> yeah, it's one of the things I like to clean out of the river. <coughs> Thanks for watching Motor City Magnet Fishers. Subscribe by hitting the circle and click the episodes on the top to watch more of our videos.